There we go. Coffee and tools this week. Uh, this thing has got to go. And first, I'm going to. Uh, it's actually a portable shed, really old by the looks of it. I'm going to take the uh, lean tos that were attached to it first and get those knocked down, and then see if we can just move the portable shed, drag it with chain or something. But uh, I'll show you what I'm up against here. They uh, at the back here. They did a lean to as well as at the side. The whole dimensional size of this thing right now is actually 18 by 21 feet back to here. So it's actually a little bit bigger than it looks, I guess. But the uh, I've already started taking the back down and starting to take the screws out and stuff. And you can see there's the old uh, portable shed that was delivered. And it's still on skids in pretty bad shape. So I'm not sure if it's going to be able to be pulled or not. I may have to just disassemble the whole thing. We'll have to see. But... Uh, Wanted to show you some of the some of the uh, things that happen here. Just stupid, but uh, look at this corner here where they were doing it, and of course all the rainwater is going to come right in here and help rot the wood out, anyways. And underneath, the, yet they spent a lot of money on fittings and screws and nails and whatever. Pretty amazing. Uh, so today, uh, I guess that's my project is to try to get some of this knocked down. The first piece I'm going to do is, is do this back piece and see if I can get all of this and get this separated from the rest of it and like fold it up like a card. Once it's on the ground, it'll be a lot easier to deal with. So I'm going to see what I can do. That's, you know, the, the basic plan. And uh, we all know a coffee and tools, how that goes. Bum, bum, bum. Well, coffee and tools were back, but uh, right now I've started, and you can see what I'm doing here. I'll show you guys what I'm up to. Uh, in order to get this mess down, what I'm doing is uh, one section at a time. So I'll take a, a roof section with the uh, two by fours and everything, and just sort of you know pull it down in one area and work my way along until I have the entire uh, pieces, everything here, you know, taken down. So there's you know uh, I've got all the sides off now. Uh, there's a lot of rusty screws. The good thing is, is I, I do have to admit, screws are pretty cool because you just take them out and it's not like nails where you're trying to pull something apart. I've had a few screws break off and you know, whatever. But uh, this week, uh, this could be another uh, interesting project down the road somewhere maybe. I don't know, I've got some wood here and I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. I have no idea. But the, um, I'm gonna continue ripping this down until we get it all down today, I hope. <laughs> Be back. Okay, go. Oh yeah. Yep. Now well, that finishes this corner. <laughs> I just coffee and tools. I just wanted to share uh, one of the jobs I'm doing right now, which is of course taking this lean-to down, and you can see the the lean-to is all pretty much uh, yep on the ground. And what I'm going to be doing next. Uh, next time is the next piece to this uh, magic which is this this side yeah I had uh, I had lean to on both sides here and I just I want the whole thing gone and out of here for my uh, metal building project I guess so that's what we got now is uh, back up a little bit so I can show it to you better there we go yeah you can see it there uh, yeah so that's it's pretty much all pretty much all down uh, at least the back side anyways I got a clean up some mess, cut some lumber up a little bit. I uh, got another idea for a project for some of this lumber, maybe. Uh, we'll have to check in and see how that, go how that goes. <laughs> right now this week, hey, thanks for watching Coffee and Tools in Texas. Oh.